Okay, so I'm going to test which browser is the fastest. I've made a few rules, got a new router, a white connection, fresh install of Windows, the latest version of the browsers, it's all connected directly. Um, and they're all going to be done to the same server. I'm going to test them individually and do three tests of each one. I've gone ahead and started on Internet Explorer here. I'm going to do the first three downloads. i um, going to talk you through the first ones. Um, you can see that one's download 0 0.22 megabytes per second, megabits per second even. Um, and then I'll, and I'll leave the, uh, the, the it to itself after that. Um, you can see I am on a really, really slow connection, so um, the browser is probably likely to make a difference other than on, on a faster connection. Um, perhaps the browser wouldn't be the bottleneck. Um, I've always been a fair believer in that there's never been a speed difference in, in browsers, but um, I'm here to find out. And I think we'll find out if um, Chrome really is the quickest as advertised by speedtest.net. And there's your average Internet Explorer, 0 0.23 megabits per second on to Firefox. So I have to say, I do like the new interface of. You can see it's painfully slow connection. Okay, there's a second test here on Firefox. Firefox is going to be marginally quicker than Internet Explorer. Um, I have to say myself, after these results, um, I have actually changed my browser, having been a fair user of Internet Explorer most of the time. I've sped up the video a little bit here if it looks quicker than the uh, download speed. Downloading at 0 0.29 megabits per second takes a long time. Firefox there averaged at 0 0.27 megabits per second on my connection. Now we're going on to Chrome, Google's Chrome web browser. Okay, so it started off a little bit quicker than Internet Explorer, not quite quicker than Firefox. Hopefully it won't be too long till I get fiber optic. I can boost my speeds hundredfold. Okay, still on with Google Chrome, not too marginally better than Internet Explorer. But actually I think it's been slower than Firefox, but we'll have a look at the results at the end and run the third test. Um, the reason I've been running three tests is just to make sure I'm getting accurate reading. Um, to make sure there's not just a one-off um, on and the bandwidth was being taken up by other things. As I said, I am the only thing on my router. I've got the wireless switched off as brand new, new microfilter, and I'm wired in, so um, no one else can be hogging my connection. So Chrome there is averaged at 0 0.25 megabits per second. Moved on to Safari, Apple's browser, which I don't really like the look of personally, um, but it has out come out extremely quick there, and you see 0 0.4 megabits per second, um, a lot quicker than the previous browsers so far, and the second one at 0 0.52 megabits per second. Safari seems to look a lot nicer when it's on a Mac than uh, when it's running on Windows. And 0 0.38 for the final one, so the average there for Safari. Uh, is 0 0.48 megabits per second. On now to Opera. Um, not one that I usually come across when I see clients' PCs. Um, first download is 0 0.39 megabits per second. Still going for the Bournemouth server here. Second download is 0 0.25 megabits per second. And then the final test for our final browser. Okay, 0 0.54 megabits per second. So quite a, quite a quick one there. Um, and another advert there for try a faster web browser, Google Chrome. Oprah averaged at 0 0.39 megabits per second. And we can see here the results. Quickest one being Safari followed by Oprah. Um, you can see there's a big difference there. Thanks for watching.